Good afternoon children. In the last class we had studied trade of both India and Brazil. Today we will continue with the topic page number 59. Through BRICS, last class we learned about BRICS. Brazil had opened a strategic partnership with India. There have been agreement between India and Brazil on trade. Observe figure 8.6. It shows trade between India and Brazil. Study the graph and answer the following questions. Let us see one by one. First question. In which year did the value of exports of Brazil exceed the import from Brazil? Answer in the year 2008, 2010, 2011, 2013, 2014 and 15. The value of exports of Brazil have exceeded the import from Brazil. That means the trade is a surplus type of trade. In which year was trade with Brazil the most favorable of all? Answer, trade with Brazil was most favorable of all in the year 2013. Next one. Comment upon the balance of trade in the year 2013. Answer, the value of balance of trade between India and Brazil was maximum in the year 2013. Also, the balance of trade was in India's favor. Next question. From which year the value of exports to Brazil have exceeded the value of import from Brazil? This is answer of answer is same as first one. 2008, 10, 11, 13, 14 and 15. The value of export, uh, export to Brazil have exceeded the import from Brazil. Next question. Write a note on the trade between Brazil and India. Trade between India and Brazil has not been consistent most of the time the trade has been favorable for india with export more than import now geographical explanation indian companies set up industrial sectors all over brazil and invested lot of capital so we are going to study what are the uh, which are the indian companies which set up industrial sectors in brazil the Indian companies invested in sectors like IT, information technology, pharmaceuticals, medicines, energy, agribusiness, means agriculture related business, mining, engineering and auto sectors, means making vehicles. In this sector, India invested a lot in Brazil. Next paragraph. Compared to India, Brazil's investment in India is smaller. The Brazilian companies have invested in automobiles, IT, mining, energy, biofuels. Biofuels means making fuels from organic matters or a waste. Foodwear sector in India. These are the Brazilian companies invested in a India. Now children, page number 59 of your textbook, Brazil. So, do you know? Children, already we learned Brazil is the uh, largest country which produce coffee so a short information is given, given about the coffee here Brazil has been the largest producer of coffee for last 150 years the plant belongs to originally to Ethiopia it was first brought to Brazil by some French settlers who established in the state of Para in the early 18th century coffee farms are called Fasandas in Brazil. Another information is given about the GST. Taxes are an important part of the economy and trade of any country. India has now switched on to the GST. Children, GST means goods and services taxes, which aim towards one tax all over the country on various commodities and services. Brazil has adopted this system from 1984 onwards, GST system. Like India, in Brazil also, GST has various slabs. Children, various GST in various slabs means different level of taxes for different uh, communities. Okay? Children, here we came to the end of the lesson. I hope you understood the lesson. Complete your assignments based on this lesson. If you are not completed, the next class we will start with a new lesson. Okay?